Hello everyone, welcome to the next session on Advanced Answers Workbench Tutorials. In this session, we will see the design of a T-shaped pipe using Design Modeler. We'll first go to Geometry and double click. Next, I'll go to Geometry and right click. New Design Modeler Geometry. Units will be millimeter, XY plane, look at. I'll go to sketching and choose line. Since it is T shape, I'll first draw a horizontal line and then a vertical line. Next, I'll give it dimensions. Both are say 600 mm. Then I'll click on look at. So this is a shape. Then I'll go to modeling YZ plane. Look at. I'll go to sketching and choose circle. I'll draw a circle and give it dimension of say 150 mm. Then I'll go to modeling and choose sweep option. Profile is the sketch two. Path is a sketch one. Generate. So this is half of the T shape. Now I'll go to XY plane and choose a new sketch. And then I'll go to sketching. I'll use line option. And from this end, I'll draw a straight line. I'll give it dimension. This half was 600. So the complete length is 1200. I'll go to sweep option again. Profile is sketch 2. Path is sketch 3. Apply and generate. So this is the T-shaped pipe which has been made. Now we want to make a hollow pipe. So I'll go to thin or surface. It's asking for faces to keep. So these are the faces. Apply. Thickness is 1 mm. Generate. So here you can see the T-shaped pipe is made. Now if you don't want to see the sketches, you can go to sketch, hide sketch. If you don't want to see this axis also, you can click over here. You will not be seeing the axis. That's the T-shaped pipe made in Design Modeler of Answers Workbench. With this, I end the session. I hope you have understood the design procedure. If you have any doubts, please write to me in the comment section. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell icon for latest video updates. See you in the next session. Thank you.